super cilia here. Is that how you say it? Super sil sil silica. Pure ionic silica energized and delivered with cells or cell power. Bone density, joint flexibility, skin, hair, and nails, teeth and gums, heart and brain, dietary supplement. This is what I've been putting in my water lately. Well, not a lot. They say whatever drops 12, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I'm just going to use 9. 9 is a complete number. I just use 9. Nighttime, whatever. I just want this knocked down. Oh, no, that's my, that's all right. Okay. Ah, okay. Hey, Breaking Brown and Vet Cornell is going to come up in a few, in a few, well, less than an hour, I think. I'll be listening to that. I have plenty of rest today so I can, whatever. Hey, look, speak about Vet, Vet Cornell. Well, not Vet exactly, but oh, let me put some glasses so I look like an intellectual. Talking to you with some authority. I was just, my, a friend of mine, Roddy Black, I just, he just subscribed to my station, and I looked at his thing, and he had something on there. And I clicked on one of them. It had T.D. Jakes on there. Well, I'm not saying nothing about T.D. Jakes. But um, I just realized, because my sister said something the other day, because I'm at my sister's house now in Virginia. It's just it's my legal residence in the United States. Anyway, all my stuff is here. My stuff, you know, some stuff, but like a lot of my books, a lot of my, you know, because I'm moving all the time. You know, you got to have a stable stability in your life. Otherwise, you can't accumulate stuff and then look back, you know, 29 years or whatever it is. Anyway, the point is, so she was saying something that says that, you know, if you really want to get to the black community, all you got to do is take, tell the women, and they got a network just like, you know, it's better than CNN, you know? I'm going like, hey, she's right. Because everybody's talking about the church and the preachers or whatever have you. But think about it. Think about it. Think for a second. If we weren't really want ADOs to take, take, take over, you don't be talking to the preachers. Talk to the women of the church because who props up the preachers but the women? Hey, the preacher can do something all messed up in like and they say the congregation is believe, but there's always some women that stay there, and that's his network. Mm -hmm. I'm serious. So if you if you want to grow, you know, we, 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 look, it takes ten percent to start a movement. You know, it, you don't need a whole lot of hey, you just keeps on. I don't know, want a lot of people to do the stuff to get some notoriety. You know, attacking this and attacking that. And all the, I, I, I'm nothing against the strategy. I don't I, I do whatever you want to do, but I have other ideas. You know, my, me, me, me. I mean, you know, <clears throat> my thing. First, you got to get to the women. Remember what 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 turned Barack Obama had nothing to do with no no men because remember when he first started. You know, Jesse Jackson wanted to kiss his ring. They, Jesse Jackson when it was was saying that you know, hey, this guy ain't got no credentials and nothing. Blah, blah blah blah. But you know, it was the women, the church women, that really pushed him when he got when he started got going right. In fact, a woman that a woman, um, a woman, told me that Barack Obama was a fraud before. His thing said, "Nah, we got you know on the ground in Chicago. You know, in Chicago, she was saying, you know, hey." Uh, she was saying she's a politically connected woman. I'm not going to tell you who it is. Like she was in California, but her network was so such that she said, "Hey, you know, this guy's suspect. He's not all that he says set out to be." So I never supported him from the beginning. Actually, you know, I didn't actually. By happenstance, I didn't have to vote for him the first time, and I certainly didn't vote for him the second time. But the point is, just now, no, Dutch, you'll do what you need to do. But if you really want this movement to take over, you got to get to the women's network. The women is the one that do it. All the church stuff has nothing to do with the big time preaching. It's the women in that, you know? You know, all this, all the, and the real work, like, like, you know, you know how many night nurses we got that's working, that work at night, and they be, what they do is talk and talk, that, and they just talk, 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 talk. You know, in fact, I would have been warned that, you know, all this, like, the, the all these uh, nurses that are coming in from, from Africa and wherever it is, you know, they're being marginalized, you know, but they can't really get to, to where, be, yeah, the, the, you're going to find this out, okay? You're just going to find this out. But to spread this word, there's two things you need. You need the women, and you need to have a presence in the arts. When I say the arts, I mean, you know, uh, you we have to, we have to, this is one of the things I want to talk about, you know, and I talk about Bill Do. Um, you, you know, if you have a popular song, starts hitting, you know, 
you know, you, you can create things like poetry contests, you know, get into the schools where you say, hey, let's talk, instead of, let's talk about not just slavery, but, you know, the ADOS, let's talk about the experience, the black experience, and you have set up poetry contests, you set up all kinds of things in, 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 in other levels, you know. I'm famous for saying this, you know, the reason why jazz was so popular, and especially in the 50s and the 60s, and that was very, very popular, is because the people that were in now, uh, in charge in the 50s and 60s, they grew up on jazz. When I say grew up on jazz, remember, uh, or even in the, well, yeah, in the 60s, what happens if, if when they, those early jazz, like the cartoons and stuff like that, the, 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 um, the soundtrack for those cartoons that she was watching was jazz, you know, sound effects and jazz, you see? So that's how it all, hmm? And in, in fact, the other thing, people keep, People keep on getting put TV. TV was nothing. You know when Donald Trump took the election last time? It wasn't television. I know it at the end, blah, 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 blah. But his basis was radio. It's audio. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Radio. Radio is less than 100 years old, but it's radio is a thing. You, they, they, with Clear Channel and them, they, they, they got this thing where basically they, they were offering... When Clear Channel first started, basically they would go to these small markets and, and, and give them free programming, absolutely free. So they had to take them, you know, until you get rid of your things, you get your Rush Limbaugh on there. And so, and truck drivers, all those kind of people like the Sirius XM, the truck, truck drivers, whatever, that's where you got to get to. You got to get to those kind of people because that's the backbone. Then when those people come in and tell their wives to do this and that, da, 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 da. Okay, if you wonder why I'm wearing sweaters, because, hey, we're in the South, but, uh, you know, they got the air conditioning going there, and I'm not really into the air conditioning. I'm really not, you know. In fact, when I was, at, I'm skipping around, but let me say this. When I went to the 1988 uh, convention, uh, Democratic convention in Atlanta, I realized what saved the, the, the South was air conditioning. Because <laughs> it's hot in the South. Mm. Let me just stop right there. It's the women, it's the arts, it's the popular music, it's the, it's the comedians. You get you get comedians to say, hey, you, you, you get some sets on ATS, whatever you want to do, that's what's going to do it. Just letting you know. Well, me letting you know. That would be me, T from the Palace, taking the chance to Tibet. Letting you know what I only suspect from ADES. Got to sign it. ADES of the ADOS. That would be an American descendants of chattel slavery.